Good morning everybody. Today I'm going to explain to you how I created and decoupage this um, furniture storage. I actually use it for my interior designing supplies but you guys can also do the same thing to store your makeup or um, something in your kitchen. Whatever you want to do. First, you'll need a heavy duty um, wrapping paper like this. I got mine from Paper Chase a while back. Um, I like the color. I wanted like a hot pink and black um, motif. And then I've got my, my Mod Podge. I got those from Michaels. You need a paper plate or a plastic bowl, a sponge applicator or a paintbrush, some ribbons. And this is actually a vinyl cover. This is not paint. I just um, cut this and stuck it on the, one of the drawers and then, you know, instead of painting it because I'm lazy that way. So what you need to do is make sure that your furniture is clean and free of dust and then um, you can prepare your um, area. I did the top one first on mine. I covered it with, um, I poured Mod Podge in this bowl and then I covered the area with Mod Podge and then once it's all sticky and tacky, you can put your paper on top. And then, you know, let it dry and then do the other sides of the furniture. Once it's done, you need to leave it for like um, two days just to make sure that there are no air bubbles in there. And once everything is dry, you need to put another coat of Mod Podge all over. Using a paintbrush or a sponge applicator, just cover the entire area with Mod Podge. This is, um, it basically seals your furniture and makes it a little bit waterproof and more durable for you. And instead of painting this black, I just got this vinyl thing from, from Michaels as well and I just measured it and cut it and then I just stuck it in there. And then I put some ribbons to just jazz it up a little bit. You can put like rhinestones or buttons in the middle. You can make it look pretty the way you want it, but that's how I basically did it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you later.